Hello, everybody, yeah. and well, damn it. <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Hyperborea, where we have a very special guest with us today. I am joined by Jake. What's up? The ceiling. Why do you ask? <laughs> well, I needed to make sure it's still there. Still is. Don't is worry. Oh, let's go. So uh, Jake is actually the uh, the map maker, the server owner, the... Jake is God! Yep, effectively. So when I curse... So when I have complaints... Oh, no. I get to direct them at you? I yep. Have a, I have a hotline to God, it. damn it, and I'm using it. Yep. Very good, very good. So, uh, first off, where the hell do I go? Oh, wait, we <laughs> discussed this prior. I'm like, probably going right. Yeah, yeah. I see, yeah, yeah. I see a dead body. Well... That's probably a... Dude. I just noticed something that was actually really, really cool here. I, uh, I got in close to an apprentice, and he actually swapped from range to melee. Yeah, yeah. That Should be able to, uh, scan that body with the, uh, book you have. Oh, okay. Scan body with book. path to the tower requires a leap of faith. Oh. Oh. So I gotta go down there. Actually, no, I have to jump. Eh, what do I got to lose? You lived! I lived! You know, that's the the one thing that I, I really do like about this map that I is other than that slight navigational hiccup, it's very easy to like figure out like where to go. Once you get on a path, I, I really like how easy it is to uh, to you know figure out where to go from there. Like that is that is very well done. Thank you. There's uh, a lot of work to make things feel intuitive. I would agree. Well, at the I same time, like, would. trying to say as little out loud as we could. And I would say you've nailed it. Like, it is very... Ooh, shit! Well, there goes the no swearing out the window. <laughs> I think that's a new personal best. I'm not dealing with that one. Optional areas offer an extra challenge, but have valuable rewards. This is an optional area. The soul well, well, there's oh. an entrance. Oh, there's an entrance. Oh, sweet Christ. Rotated. Why can everything, like, look at me and kill me? It's not fair. <laughs> so, so what inspired you to make this map? Uh, and, like, what were your inspirations? I, I have some... I have some theories. Damn it. You have some theories. I was definitely getting like a, in reading the description, I was start I was definitely getting a sort of Lovecraftian vibe off, off of the whole, you know, explore find the things that have no name, that sort of uh, uh, fear of the For unknown sure. sort of thing. That was what that's what I was getting off of it. Obviously, I was probably really wrong. I'm kind of used to it at this point, but uh, you know, I guess just why? Shit. <laughs> so you you are right about the Lovecraft thing uh, I think I started working on this map after I read Mountains of Madness mm -hmm. and uh, essentially what happens in that is there's a group of researchers in Antarctica and they discover a uh, ruined city made by aliens millennia ago and other stuff happens but uh, I just like the idea of you know, strange ruins that have just been hidden in just an inhospitable region the whole time. Yeah, this definitely isn't friendly. Yeah. Why does everything here look like it wants to hurt me? It probably does. Oh. Well. It's a lunatic. Not a problem. Well, I, I gotta say, it, it's very impressive. You definitely nailed the don't come here vibe of this place. For sure. It feels good to know that I was right about the Lovecraft thing. I can take some semblance of self-satisfaction now. I, unlike as far as people, like... can die happy now. 
as far as like uh, gameplay goes, it's kind of a weird mix of Souls likes and Bloodborne in particular, and uh, some like old FPS games. Old FPS, really? Yeah. So there's there's a little bit of the arena shooter like Doom Eternal, but uh, it's also there's sense of like classic uh, Doom or Blood 1997. Something's growling at me. Oh, nope, we're good. It stopped growling at me. I'm in the soul well now. Sorry to interrupt. Yeah. It's just, oh. Thank you, benevolent map maker. I ap I appreciate the respawn point there, Ed. It's like you knew this man cannot parkour. <laughs> give him the give him the good respawn point. Yeah, at one point there was a lot more parkour, but then it it got toned down pretty heavily. Oh, okay. Yeah, I definitely appreciate that. I mean, I I think there's a I think the amount of parkour that's in here, mind you, the fact that I can't seem to uh, uh, navigate it anyways, is like the perfect amount. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I'm like focusing on like thirty different things at once. Oh well, things want to. Ooh. Oh. Sweet Christ, are you seeing this? <laughs> Mercenaries. Always. Just. I don't want to. Thank you. All right. I'm sorry. I'm like focusing on like 30 different things at once, and my natural instinct is to just scream at them. <laughs> oh, uh, where were we? Uh, Old Doom, you say? Yeah, yeah. I did not get an FPS vibe from this, but now I'm going to have to try and pay attention. No, I mean, there's not a lot of guns, obviously. Oh. But weird turrets are okay. These, uh, those... Dude, how did you do all this? This is just freaking crazy. Yeah, so, lots of plugins, uh, some command blocks are in there. Um... So this only is played on a server because of how many different... Yeah, yeah. Is it... Are you trying to keep this all well, like a secret, or it's it's just not practical to run? So, on a... it's yeah, yeah. So part of it is like uh, some of these plugins are paid for, so oh, yeah. I'm not actually like allowed to share them. If not legally, then at least ethically. So that's a very good point. I didn't. I never thought. I never thought of that. So that's one thing that's actually a very new concept for me that you can pay for plugins. Yeah, yeah. So this is mostly using the Mythic Craft plugins, so Mythic Mobs and Mythic Crucible. They did a fantastic job implementing it. Why does everything here want to yeah. hurt me? Can't we just find, like, once a friendly, ci a friendly abandoned civilization? Just once? No. No. <laughs> Ooh. Why does everything want to hurt? Just one time, I want a friendly adventure map or adventure server. <laughs> a friendly... I don't know what to call this. Whatever this is. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> okay, thank God. I, I feel less guilty now not knowing. This yeah, it's is... kind of hard to market this thing. I, I noticed. I, I I tried to figure out how best to like phrase this thing in like, my title and description. And th so, the YouTube... Oh, cool. I killed something. What did I win? Oh, oh. Boost the effect of the electric claymore. Nice. Sorry to interrupt. It's like I'm, I'm like, I'm, per I'm no, making no, no, progress no. finally. I've been lost for the last day, <laughs> and this is like all new for me. Please tell me there's a checkpoint nearby. That's cool. I take that back. It 
doesn't stay down. <laughs> oh, do I have to like... I think I get it now. I think I get it. I have to... I gotta make a big jump, right? Yep. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Oh, thank you, benevolent map creator. Oh, well, I guess I could just thank this other strange voice in my head. And who's he talking about? Thank you for... Oh! Yes, sir! Right. That went well. How do I get down? Oh, hell yeah! Dude, the Rogue Alchemist is, like, my favorite little, like, just thing in this game so far. Mm. I, I, I love, I love the, uh, I guess it's not my favorite thing in this map so far, but it's definitely a great, oh, addition. Oh. Oh, right. Okay! That does some damage now. I found one of the researchers. I think. Just killed him. Enemy aiming. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Ah, there we go. I get it. Dude, I'm I'm loving this creation so far. Like this has been like an absolute just treat to play. Like this is I played like a ton of maps over the years. Well, I guess this is technically a server, but still, this point stands that this is just... Wow! Fantastically put together. Like, definitely enjoying my time here. I'm very glad. Um, I, I, very definitely, hear that. I definitely like the... Uh, just the builds. Like, in general. Like, this is... Oh, yeah. Like, I like this whole shattered world premise. I, I definitely mm. can kind of see the Dark Souls Bloodborne kind of vibe to it now that I now that I really give it some serious thought. Yeah, no. I did uh like ninety-nine percent of the builds with some exceptions. Well I can definitely see the uh, the love and care and I, I do like, you know, the little touches in the builds and I really do must be destroyed with electricity. What did I just do? You got a power up. <laughs> Dude. Dude. This has been an awesome bonus world. Oh, uh, just stay there. Thank you. Uh, I definitely like you like you said I do like that there is uh an an element of uh nonverbal uh just stop. Thank you. Hello? What got me? There is an enemy sneaking up on you. Oh. Uh, did you got did you do uh, did you do tweaks with the AI? Uh lots of tweaks. Lots of tweaks. Like, how did you do that? Like is this just all like one big giant is this all like command block work that you did this with or is this the plugins pulling a little bit of weight here this yeah this is mostly the plugins so i am able to tweak the regular ai a little bit and like change their behavior like under what conditions do they attack the player how do they attack the player and then beyond that i'm able to do things that kind of simulate behavior if that makes sense, like I'm able to make enemies strafe you or jump around, do crazy stuff. Depending on how far you get into the map, you'll see the, the real extent of that. But I kind of try and ease the player in to the craziness just from vanilla Minecraft as a base. Oh, very good. Very, I do. Yes. Thank you for easing me into this. As you can see, I'm already struggling. Ooh. Oh, hell yeah. That 
is a fantastic power up. Is that out? That, that is out. That is out. Am I done with this area? Pretty uh, much. Oh, cool. Oh. Oh. That's a cool effect. Nothing there. You spawn anchor, not a despawn anchor. Dude, <laughs> Gotta that, make sure. that threw me for such a loop the first time. I hope you know how paranoid I am now. <laughs> Freaking despawning. Ooh, I did see that I uh, I caused a patch note. Oh right, yeah. I've never seen that happen before, so I don't know. I was able to figure out how to add a safeguard to prevent that. Well, you'll you'll find when I when I play maps, I have a tendency to uh, everything breaks. And it's nothing wrong with the maps, it's just, it's just me. Like, everything I do just has a tendency of breaking things. I don't know what it is. It's my curse, I guess. I was, I was playing one map. I, I want to say it was, um... Oh, you know what it was? It was Elden... I think it was Elden World. Or something of, or something of that nature. Mm. I want to say it was Elden World. And I managed to get outside of the boundaries of the map. Because uh, I thought yeah. that was the way I had to go. And what I what I didn't appreciate about about uh, or I, what I didn't appreciate that they did was they locked me out of like creative mode, so I could uh, so it's not like I could even fix it. Not like I, I I got to a point where I just could not get back inside the map, and it sucked. Okay, is the yeah. storm thing on purpose? The lightning, yeah. Okay, because <laughs> that just scared the shit out of me, man. <laughs> oh, it's, a, it's a diplomat. I, it's gonna cause a diplomatic issue here, I suppose. Nope, nope. nope your diplomatic immunity's been revoked. Ow. Nailed it. Christ, sorry, I'm like. I, want, I have so many questions, but brain is focusing really hard right now on not dying. Okay. Where were we? Right. Tell me the lore. Oh, Christ. No. <laughs> it's a uh, very mysterious story. I can say that much. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Thank you. Uh, I, w I would definitely I could say... give you some background on this, the setting. Oh, sure. Yeah, I'll take, sure. I'll take background. So, essentially, the setting that you're in uh, is in the world of Saren Den, mm -hmm. which is a flat disk. So the flat earthers and were so, right. Yes, the flat earthers were right in this time. Finally. <laughs> And uh, essentially, you've gone off the northern edge of the map, where there shouldn't be anything, and yet there is. Yes, there's a wide variety of things that want to hurt me. Just... Sorry, focusing. Okay, now I can breathe a second. Actually, I highly doubt I'm going to be able to breathe because I recognize that button. So before I walk in there... <laughs> That's uh, not the, a good button. No, that isn't a good did I just walk through an airship? You did. Zeppelins. Oh, let's do this. Holy shit, that was awesome. The Crimson Prince. That did like no damage to him. What have you made, you absolute animal? I assume this guy's upset at me for some reason. Probably because I exist, isn't it? Wait, I'm coming into these this peop these people's worlds and systematically slaughtering. Am I the bad guy in this situation? Asking for a friend. You're not the worst guy. Oh. So, at least there's that. That's fair. I guess I can get behind that. So 
So you put these people in perpetual torment. Are, are you the worst guy? <laughs> the creator of the map? I guess so. Oh. Ooh, wow. Your friend here, Mr. Prince. The uh, enemy formerly known as Prince. He's very unhappy at me right now. Dude, this is just so freaking cool, man. Like, I know this is the plugins, like, doing a lot of work, but just the way you've implemented this, it's just so cool. So obviously, I'm sure the folks at home are going to be wondering, you know, what's next? Are you just what's gonna next keep, for you, me? Yeah, are you just going to keep uh, updating this map? Oh, hello! Uh, no, we're probably done with Hyperborea, unless it, you know, suddenly gets a ton of traction. And people are demanding me to make more. But okay. there's already a, a large amount of content. Uh, just with the base game, there's four endings. Wow. And with sort of a new game plus thing, there's three challenge modes. And all of the challenge modes, in addition to adding some extra difficulty, add extra content as well. You really do hate so. your audience, don't you? <laughs> Only as much as they hate themselves. <gasps> your audience so. hates itself right about now. <laughs> there is a permadeath. Which I think you might have seen in the pub area. Yes, like I a, did. I was curious. A little area with all the people who have beaten the permadeath mode. Yes, and I was very curious why anybody in their right mind would do that to themselves, but... So, not only have some people done the permadeath mode, but they've also done it with all of the challenge modes on, on at once. Man, I thought Which I, I didn't think was was anyone anyone would even, like, attempt, but they have been successful. I think two people have done that. So, all three challenge modes is permadeath and... You take extra damage from every attack, and you don't heal from killing enemies. Oh, that's just mean. Why would you make that a thing? Well, you know, people were saying this game's too easy, so... Those people are idiots. Stop listening to them. Maybe you're right. Okay. Oh, man, this guy's... I hate this guy. Ah, we, ow! Why don't you take additional damage from range? Oh my god. He's dying to a prince. God, when the Disney princess was singing about one day my prince will come, this is not what I think they had in mind, man. Oh! I would have to agree. Are these just all wither? Well, I'm dead. Are these all just uh, wither skeletons that you've dressed up? Yeah, yeah. Oh. So. I forgot to jump. The uh, resource pack is pretty minimalist. I didn't want to change it too much from vanilla Minecraft. Even the uh, like custom weapons are still 2D and have a very vanilla Minecrafty look. Oh yeah, I did. Uh, yeah, I can. Yeah, I can definitely get that. I'm definitely getting that vibe. Okay. Oof. He does not like it when you get close to him, does does he? Okay. Yeah, I get it now. I get it now. I understand him. I have figured out the prince. I totally got it this time. Yeah. Ah, there it is. That's cute. I like that. You stun him, he explodes. That's uh, that's actually really, really smart. No, he's just doing that whenever you get close. Nothing to do with the stun. But you do have to get close to stun him. Correct. I, ha I, ha I have discerned that. Yeah. Is he flammable? Asking for a friend. No. Damn it. 
that friend will be disappointed. Oh. He is. Sending you angry messages about it right now? Uh, yes. If by friend and angry messages you mean my brain and he's thinking up mean things to say, then yes. <laughs> oh, sweet Christ. So I have to, I, another thing I have to ask about, just for mostly my curiosity's sake. On the man-eaters, why? Oh, yeah. The man-snatchers. So... <laughs> why? Just, why? <laughs> so, did, did it, you, it's did, kind of a bit of nostalgia. Did you not enjoy, um, ha enjoy having your player base have fun? Yeah, no, I don't want them to have that. Oh, okay, just checking. Um, God, are you from software? <laughs> I wish. Hire me. Okay. But, uh, From software, if anybody's watching, hire this man. He hates his player base. I don't know if you were around for, like, Minecraft when the Endermen were just added. But, like, no one really understood the Endermen, and they were kind of the scary mob that sort of broke all the rules. Like, they were able to teleport. They're tall and scary and make scary noises. And, uh, I think as, like, time has gone on, you know, people understand Minecraft much better. The Enderman is just another mod. I kind of wanted to bring them back as a terrifying force. <laughs> well, mission accomplished! Yep. Imagine my surprise when I'm trying to beat an Enderman into the ground and he's not going down in five or six hits. And then he gets pissed at me. Oh, sweet Christ. I say that and... <laughs> and immediately this guy gets pissed at you. Does he have a second weapon now? Is he making the Enderman noise? Have I done? Yeah, now he attacks even faster. Oh goody, I was I was worried that this was getting too easy. Oh! You know what? You win, I'm now pissed. potion didn't last as long as I thought it would. I, I, I had cheesed one of the, the Enderman things, like super hard, in a previous episode, killed one, and got a sick potion off of him. Oh! That's not fair! Oh, it's probably fair. Where are you supposed to get in range? Please say something encouraging, man. I can't stand the silence. Yeah, uh, you, you got this. You got this. <laughs> this guy's a joke. Easiest boss in the game. Well, maybe that's not an encouraging thing to no, say. No, that wasn't an encouraging thing to say. If this is the easiest boss in the game, I'm quitting right now. <laughs> no, he's... Yeah, this is one of the optional areas, so uh, yeah. all the bosses in them are very difficult compared to what you'll know normally encounter. You mean the bosses hate? Yes. Oh god, it's me, These Margaret. guys hate you even more. I was really looking forward to, like, using the hell out of that Enderman potion, but it didn't quite work out like I had hoped. Gently. Your bosses are very good at keeping just keeping players on their toes. Like, there's a lot of mechanics that I've I've noticed. There's it's very your bosses are very multi mechanic. Like it's not just go, you know, whack a mole on them. Like there's jumping, there's actual dodging. You can only wail on them for so long before they explode. Yeah. For every boss, I tried to make it so there was some skill that was being reinforced. What am I reinforcing on this one? Uh, I think all of them. Ah, <laughs> oh, very good. 
was very worried I was having too easy of a time. Oh, that was on me. I jumped right into him. Oof. Yeah. Dog crossbow. Oh, he also has the electric claymore, so he can stun you too. Why did you... Why would you feel the need to give him an electric claymore? You know... It was, it was too easy otherwise. Oh, yes, it was too easy otherwise. Ah! I mean, lore-wise, he's part of the group that uh, made the electric claymore, so... Oh! Yes, he's very good at wielding it! That did some damage. I gotta say, I love the electric claymore like that. I hate it when people add in weapons that don't really change. Like, yeah. change gameplay. Like, the electric claymore not only felt like a legitimate upgrade, but honestly, like... A good, ooh, a good, just like a good change. Oh shit, I did it again. Yeah, so, tried to make it so all of the weapons are tools more than anything, as opposed to just numerical am I, upgrades. Am I going to get a battle axe like a throw at people? Uh, not sure how much I should say. Okay. There's some pretty crazy weapons, though. Um, even with, like, uh, like, elemental weaknesses, I, uh, don't like it when, like, you know, they're introduced as just, uh, your weapon now does fire damage, and this enemy type is weak to fire damage, and then yada yada, ah! lightning or water or whatever. This, with this, I tried to make it so all the different elemental types of damage you do change the way you approach the gameplay. Um, maybe haven't noticed that quite yet, but you will eventually. I have noticed that lightning stuns the armored enemies, obviously. True. <laughs> oh, looks like he didn't despawn. Not upset by that. He will still uh, probably kill me. We'll just choose not to fix that. Thank you. Oh, call it the streamer version. Stress release version. Yeah, the stress release version. Thank you. Yeah. I did it. Completely unaided. <laughs> <laughs> so was, that was the easiest of the optional areas. This was the easiest. Why, thank you. I'm the... elated. So Second and third might cause more issues. <laughs> and so the sex converged there to the well of souls where I ascended to knighthood. It was known to us, yet still to us it was sacred. The wise ones in the lighthouse would go to dissect those pools of essence, peering into the waters of mercury and ash, saw the boundaries of Spirea. I secured knowledge. That was a lot of nonsense. Yes. I... Is this a bad time to mention I'm on record as being anti-jumping into pits? Well, there's going to be a few pits. <laughs> Alright, I won't jump into the pit. I'll fall. Oh, no. Oh, uh, uh, it... oh. That was nice. It was actually nice. Ooh. Just inherently better boots. Poison one. Ceremonial dagger. Assembling. Burton's weapon cooldowns. It's an offhand item. And now I just deal poison? No, it only does poison when you're holding it in hand. Oh, okay. Cool. Probably not that useful this early in the game. Not that useful this early in the game. What did I have here? Conductivity 2. I still in the... Where the hell am I? Am 
my nearest respawn point. I, I assume I'm going to go up. Yep. I'm going to go yep. up. Caught in the tractor beam. Oh. Let me... Thank you. All right. I, I gotta say, I really like the whole kill shit to heal mechanic. That's just lovely. I, I like I like that you're in a way, hey, you're low on health. Go. Murder. Kill. Yeah. I guess that is in a way kind of like Just you. trying to keep the player consistently engaged. There was a version of the map at one point where that wasn't a mechanic and you just passively regent. And it really? ultimately led to very boring gameplay. I would imagine people played much more passively than you yeah, would intend. Whenever there is a boss fight, they just uh, run to the other side of the arena and shoot projectiles infinitely. Who would shoot projectiles infinitely? A nerve. Well, it didn't help that there is uh, like a trident that you could just throw and it, then it would come back to you. So you could just do that forever. Right now, all of your ranged attacks have ammo. So you'll eventually run out. I feel like I'm in a really weird painting. <laughs> Where did you come from? Okay, bye. Yes. Ah! Stupid friggin' bats. Yeah, this is like that weird painting with the staircase, and it just. <laughs> Yep. Makes no sense. This is on making no sense. I'm. I think. Oh, nope. I'm not lost anymore. Scratch that. I'm lost again. <laughs> uh. Uh. Okay, just run towards things that are trying to kill me. I don't think I can run towards that guy. He just fell from above me, and I appreciate the bats, though. Avid fan of the bats. Yeah. So another thing we can do with plugins is uh, make it so uh, one enemy is actually using the AI of a different mob in Minecraft. And uh, essentially the server is just lying about what the mob is. So, all the bats are actually parrots. <laughs> really? Yes. <laughs> I've been murdering parrots like a bloodthirsty maniac this whole time. Yeah. I am an asshole here. Ah! Stupid! Not allowed to yell at the parrots. That doesn't make me feel any less guilty about killing them. Go away! I don't want to... You've done this to me. You've turned me into the asshole. Am I going the right way? I'm going up, so I'm assuming you're yes. going up. You're going up. Oh. Map. Uh. I believe you're about to run to another NPC. Oh, goody. Is it Horus? A Dark Souls reference Is it there. what? Horus. It's a Dark Souls. Oh, Horus. Right. Nah, that's the... No. I panicked. That was the More only... of a Solaire. <laughs> Alright. I will care way more about this NPC if there's a respawn point. Oh, it is Solaire. And there's the sun. Hello, ah. my friend. We've gone beyond the edges of the world. It's exciting, what do you think? I I love this NPC. I will die for this NPC. I will kill other people for this NPC. Ha. Oh my gosh, he's awesome. Ha. Kindness goes far in a place like this. Thank you, Solaire. Ha. Ooh. I like his sword. Say, do you know anything about the apostate? Ah, I'm trying to enjoy a moment 
Thank you. Do I know anything about the apostate? I know things about a prostate. I met a bloke. <laughs> you would not believe the number of times I've heard that joke. <laughs> oh. Damn, I thought I was being clever there for a second. Please tell me I will meet this NPC again. You will. Thank you. Please tell me that he actually has, like, a halfway decent fate. Oh, I don't want to say anything. Oh, that means he doesn't. No spoilers. No spoilers. That means he doesn't. Back down, now I'm going back. Good God. Sir, how many drugs are you on? This is a... Why would you build this? <laughs> Sir! Sir, do you have a happy home life? That's oh. pretty good. Oh, okay, just checking. You're certainly making me pay for it. I know it's not about me, but I'm the only one here. Well, I guess you're... I went in a circle! Did I make a wrong turn at Albuquerque? Yep. Damn it. This this whole map is set in Albuquerque. Oh. Nope, don't want to go down there, I don't think. Okay, now I'm both lost and confused. And a little hungry, but that's unrelated. I'm here, I would like to get up there. Uh. Uh. Um. I'm panicking because I don't know where to go. Do I have to go down to go up? I don't think I need to go down to go up. Can't I just go up? Is there like somebody I can stop and ask for directions from? Well, me, probably. Oh. If I ask for the directions, will you give them you, to me? Uh, you're in the right area when you're back up there. Oh, thank you. That helps me, I think. Like, I'm not going to, like, flip the world upside down, right? Like, that's not a thing that happens, right? I'm not going to yeah, end up on the ceiling. Way. There's not a plug-in for that? No, no. Yeah, that's the way. That is the Gotta way? Go down. Yep. Okay. Well, I'm committing. Uh, okay. Uh. I think I committed a tad bit incorrectly. Oh, I'm in the right area. You said so. Magical god voice. True. Don't let it go to your head, kid. <laughs> ah! Why does everything want to hurt me? I just want to be friends. Although I do appreciate that the bats just are like free heals. I def I mm. definitely do appreciate that from the bottom of my heart. But that was the one thing I'd like I made note of in my head. It's like, oh boy, free heal. Alright. Uh Siri, where do I go? I know your name's not Siri, but help a brother out. Uh, gotta jump on those boxes back up onto that wall there. Oh. Uh, I did it how many times before perfectly? And I embarrassed myself in the last... Okay, I'm here. Yeah, there's a little balcony thingy on your right. Other side. How did these guys keep 
keep coming from? That? Ah! Oh no. Well, that's a setback. <laughs> Damn it! Okay, now I forgot how the hell I... Oh yeah, this is definitely a setback. Damn it! <laughs> I hate these apprentices. This is, there is a little infamous. <laughs> really? What? For driving people to drugs and alcohol? Ah, you stupid... Damn, apprentices. Just... Please leave me alone. I just want I just want to complete this area so I can look good in front of complete strangers. Oh right. Okay, now I kinda remember where I'm at. Yep, there we go. Alright, we're doing it. Oh, hang on. Second. Uh, Praise the sun! Oh. <laughs> he has more dialogue! I will die for you. He is best boy. I love him. I love him as he is one of, as if he was one of my own. I don't have any, but yeah, I, I would think love he's, him nonetheless. He's most people's favorite NPC. And rightfully so. Did you see how big his frickin' sword was? Or his spear? I mean, of course you've seen yeah. how big his spear is. That's not like a euphemism or anything. No, no. Man's got a large spear. I think it's a spear. Without a doubt. Or is it a halberd? It's a spear. Cool. Of some kind. Alright, so where were we? Oh. Yeah, there you go. There we go. Oh, did I miss the... Ah, stairs. Nice. Wait. That's not the right way, is it? No, you're going the right way. Oh, good. Ah. Stupid frickin' apprentices! Why won't you just leave me alone? Anyways. I'm sorry, I'm getting... I got angry at the... I got angry at your NPCs. It's not right. <laughs> I need to be getting angry at you! Can I make that jump? For sure. You got a guy behind you. Oh. Are you watching me? Oh right. I'm always we discussed watching. this we discussed I'm this earlier. Watching. You're invisible. <laughs> Hello God, it's me, Margaret. I don't know what yeah, that's... there's one of the benefits of uh being on a server I can spy on everyone while they're playing. Oh goody. I keep going up or is that out? That looks like out. I would like out. I don't care if there's secrets. Damn it, it wasn't out! Why won't you just die? Oh god, he's getting away. Ah, got him. Nailed it! Seriously, you just like. You must be. In, you gotta be invisible. I am. You're just. No. Let's not talk about that. Oh, we're fine. We're fine. Wait, how far back did that set me? <laughs> I'm lost. I turned fair. around. Wait, no, I don't need to go this way. I need to. Wait, no, I do go this way. No, wait, no, I go this way. Can I make this jump? I should be able to. I think I should. Yeah. And there we go. Very nice. I, I do like that there is minimal parkour in this map, and it's like an adventure first and foremost. Although I'm stopping to kill this guy again. 
as heck on that Yeah, way. definitely didn't want to uh, make any difficult jumps. <laughs> it's really satisfying, like, multi-hitting this guy. <laughs> yeah, no difficult jumps, and yet I can still I can still fail at the most basic of parkour. Yeah, it happens to the best of us. Going that way don't seem right. Going that way seems right. Does that seem right to you? God? I mean, I did make the map, so it does seem right to me. <laughs> okay. Big jump. Oh, hey. Was this finally out? Hallelujah. Oh, for... I hate cultists. I really hate cultists. Where's the checkpoint? Oh. Will the cultists follow me? Let's hope not. I, would, I wouldn't go in there. <laughs> not yet. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Hallelujah. That would have been a mistake. That would have been a huge mistake. I would have been... At that point, I would have had you miracle my ass back to this point. <laughs> Am I still in the bonus world? Is it still no, going? No, no. You made your way out. Where the hell am I? <laughs> Where's the hub area? I'm very lost and very confused and very frightened. Why have you made this? I mean, I just made the game that I thought I would want to play. So, if it's terrible, we only have my taste to blame. Oh, wait, is this supposed to be... Uh... Ah! Oh! Uh, wow! Um... Is that supposed to be Orenstein and Smo? Not so subtly, yeah. <laughs> okay. Just checking. Just checking. Yep. Definitely see it now. What? Whoa! Holy shit! Why? Jesus Christ! What have you done? Oh. Am I just allowed to... Nope, I'm not. Oh, I pissed them. I pissed them off. I pissed them off. Are you enjoying the show? You enjoying... Are you enjoying yep. this? Oh, good. I'm glad you're enjoying this. Isn't it great getting? Isn't it? Isn't it great hearing su the suffering of of people live in person? Oh, they're throwing axes at me. Isn't that wonderful? Then the one's got a sight. May I, may I ask you a personal question? You may. Why do you hate me so? Oh, come on, don't you? You stay the hell away from me, Bloodletter, Kellum. That is actually doing a remarkable amount of damage to him. Yeah, neither of them are too tanky. Well, thank you for that. I'm switching back to the other weapon. I love this grave bow so much. Like, it might be my second favorite weapon in the game. Remember how you said people would run away from the bosses and just shoot them? <laughs> Well, it's still an option. Okay, just checking. Oh, he's throwing axes still. Oh, no. 
Oh no! I didn't realize that it used multiple shots when I fired it. I've learned something new today. Uh, it just uses one arrow. Oh. Well, in that case. But, uh, unlike the crossbow, it doesn't uh, leave arrows on the ground where you shot. So, the crossbow's Wait. technically more ammo efficient. Oh no, you didn't. I may have. Why? <laughs> Oh god, he's ascended. He's upset. He's probably very upset that I killed his buddy now, isn't he? You killed his buddy. He's got a new buddy. Why is he so upset? <laughs> the rules of this world are weird. People are upset at me for no reason. I just walked in here. They decide to attack me. You were walking all over the yard exhibit. It belongs in a museum. I like that Indiana Jones reference I just made there. Yep, yep. Did you see the new movie? I have not. Uh, might see it next week. Oh, very good, very good. I personally have no plans to see it. Disney tanked <laughs> all my stock. Oh, time to run again. Well, I have a friend who wants to see it, so. Oh, you're more seeing it for him? I have not. Ooh! Yeah, yeah. Oh! <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Obviously, I killed the wrong guy first. And run. This is going way so, uh, better than the... One of the... Oh, go ahead. One of the neat things about the uh, stun mechanic is that uh, it doesn't just give the enemy slowness. Sometimes if they're doing attacks, it'll actually interrupt. <laughs> He has a little follow-up dash there, but because he stunned him, he didn't do it. Oh! Yes, I noticed that the follow-up dash almost killed me. <laughs> I'm very intimately familiar with that. And running. Oh, he threw meat on the ground. Oh, nope, nope, I whiffed that shot. Well, I whiffed it. Okay. You'll notice that most of my gameplay and commentary... Oh! Hello! Goodbye! Much better. Where is he? Not who I was referring to. Ha! <laughs> oh. As I, as I was saying, you'll notice most of my gameplay devolves into me screaming. <laughs> that's, well, that's most I've, of my commentary, I've, is me just screaming at least fear. At least you're not bored, you know? That's the worst thing it could do. <laughs> yes, thank God this isn't a horror map. Not yet. No. Don't you do that to me. <laughs> do you know how many horror maps I've been through? Mostly oh. unwillingly. No! He's one shot away! Is that the crossbow load? Shit. Ho! Oh! Excuse me, I just need to... Wow! Wow! Get mercury contaminated blood. That's uh, one of the three items you needed. I don't even know how I got here. <laughs> Burning enemies return extra health when killed. So you also got a uh, new sword from that. Oh, I didn't even notice that. 
Dude, you're just like a generous. All right, I'm gonna. And all of them heal on. Huh. Lovely. What the? What is? Ah! Ah! I'm... Go away! Where's, like, the hub area? I am still very lost. You're on your way back. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. So I'm, like, done with that hole, you douchebag. You stupid. Oh, no, I'm not fighting. I need to run. <laughs> I have died to that guy so many times. <laughs> so many times. Oh, thank God. Oh, sweet Christ. Oh, my poor heart can't take it anymore. <laughs> All right. So before we end the episode, I'm going to allow you shameless plug anything that you want to. What do you want to promote? Uh, uh, the map. Play the map. <laughs> Get on the server. All that. Play this map. If you hate yourself and like Dark Souls, play this map. Yep. That's it for you. Yeah, that's pretty much it. All right. Well, I think, I think I'm good. You good? I'm good. Uh, I'm good. Very good. Well, thank you all very much for watching, and we'll see you all in the next episode. Yeah.